Looking for tips on all things art business related? Social media for artists? Or one line art? This is the place for you. Welcome to my channel. If you still haven't chosen a Valentine's Day gift for your loved one, hear me out. I am going to be teaching you how to do a couple's one line portrait that you can actually draw, print at home, and put into a nice frame before your Valentine's Day. So without getting into too much detail, here's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be taking two separate photos of two people who are not in the same frame, putting it together on Procreate, doing it with one line art style into a portrait, and then you're going to have your gift ready. It's going to be unique, it's going to be personalized, it's going to be something that not everyone gets for their loved one, so it's gonna be unconventional. So if you're down to it, me too. Let's get started. All right, guys, so let's get right to it. If you don't have Procreate on your iPad, I suggest you download it. Um, it's a one-time payment for lifetime use. So, and, and it's like $10 or so, I think. Um, and yeah, first of all, I'm gonna show you what you, show you guys the photos that I chose. So I chose this photo of this guy whom we're calling the boyfriend and where i got a photo of this girl whom we're calling the girlfriend and we are going to be um creating a photo a couple photo a couple portrait from both from both of them i'm just gonna use my eraser and i'm gonna just uh chop her off a bit chop off the photo so that i can get to her easier I don't need any of that. And the same with him. So I'm just gonna choose his layer. And I'm gonna... Okay. So even if you don't have a photo with your loved one, you can always just make one from two separate photos where you guys are... Um, where you guys look nice. So. Um, if you guys notice on this case, in this case, I chose uh, positions or poses in which um, they're both leaning towards each other. So, so I'm going to put her like this and him as well. So they're like um, just just leaning towards each other. So she's leaning towards him and he's leaning towards her just that it looks a bit more intimate. I'm gonna erase as much as I can until I reach her hair. Just so that I have an idea of what my photo, of what my, um, what my portrait's gonna look like. Um, I think he looks a little too high up in the drawing. Okay, so I'm going to take that. Just gonna put them straight. I had to go back. And I had to I have to erase more of of the remainder 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 of the photo. I guess her face is well sized there. She should be a little bigger because she's in front of him. And uh, maybe I'll put her more like this. Okay, here we go. I guess that makes sense. And I'm just gonna um, make it look like he's hugging her. So I'm just gonna cut his arm off and put it on top of her. So. It's gonna go here, hit cut. And I'm just gonna paste, it's gonna paste on, paste on a separate layer. 
then I can take her and put her here and I'm gonna take him and um, put his arm sort of here bit more on top of her sort of and she a little lower She's on top of the back of his arm, but we're gonna put her somewhere here. Something like this. Okay, now we take all of these things, center them. And we get to our drawing. First of all, I want to put this all in a layer just because um, it's easier to move. And I'm going to make it as transparent as possible and get right to it. Let's go. As usual, I use my thick and thin um, personalized brushes on Procreate. If you want them, I just, just hit me up. I have them for free in my procreate class if you don't have access to procreate just write to me via dms through instagram You might be wondering why 
I decided to close his eyes. That's because I want to make the photos look, photo look the most homogeneous as possible. His eyes are closed because I'm going to make her eyes closed as well to make the photo look more serene. But also, um, in this uh, example photo, they're both looking uh, weirdly at the camera and I want to show more intimacy. So um, I'm going to probably do two versions, one without eyes and one with eyes. But here we go. So I made a couple's photo from two separate, independent, completely unrelated images. And this is how you master <laughs> the art of making couple photos out of nowhere. And yeah, I really hope this helps you create a nice um, Valentine's Day gift. I really hope that was useful to you and I really hope that it came out 
perfectly. If you have any questions or doubts or you want me to help you set up your drawing or help you with correcting your drawing, feel free to reach out to me here in the comment section below. Send me a text message, not, not a text message. <laughs> Send me a DM on Instagram and I will answer you as soon as I can. And yeah, happy Valentine's Day. Enjoy.